Hi, it's me, Ross Matthews, and I'm here with Cal Penn. Hello. Hi. So this is Rapid Fire, Ross. I'm going to yep. hit you with some real quick ones. Great. I'll uh, give you quick answers. What is the most surprising part about being engaged? Oh, the most surprising? That's such a good question. Nobody's actually ever asked me that. Probably that I could have set up a registry. Oh, yeah. For all the people who show you so much love and congratulate you, I was like, well, if I had known that, I would have set up like a nice big registry and uh, all the stuff we want. The one thing you do want, and I love that it came to you on a dream, you were on a flight. Yeah. Cardi B was on the flight. <laughs> yeah. You fell asleep and had a dream that she officiated right. your wedding. Correct. You tweeted it. I tweeted it and I didn't even tag her because I thought it might be rude to tag her. I didn't want to, like, I have so much respect for her. I didn't want to do anything that would be perceived as shade, but she sees the tweet somehow yeah. and responds to it. And she says, I'm down. Not only is she down, she's apparently officiated weddings before and she's got the whatever paperwork you need. Yeah. And she said she was super down. So now it's on us because we need to find a date. So when you are when you get on your phone and Cardi yeah. B is like tweeting you back and saying, yeah. I'll officiate your wedding. Yeah. What, what do you do? You look and you just I say yes? Yes. I mean, obviously I couldn't believe it. And then I, I like sent the screenshot to like 20 of my friends. I'm like, yo, you guys. So is it happening? I mean, I hope so. We uh, we we haven't really been planning the wedding yet because of COVID and sure. mostly because of COVID. So we, we We'll see. We want it to be safe for our guests when of we do course. it. Of course. We have to talk about what you did when you went and worked at the White House. Yeah. It blows me away. I'm fascinated by all things politics. Uh, cool, yeah. You have been there in yeah. the White House. Yeah. Like, what does it smell like? Uh, freedom. It smells like freedom, <laughs> Ross. USA! What does yeah. freedom smell like? Like the White House. <laughs> And you worked there during the Obama years. I did. What yeah. is one thing that we don't know about Barack Obama? That's the thing about people who have been in the public eye or and or the leader of the free world. In that case, obviously you're working on things that are very important for a lot of people and the stakes are really high and it can be a high stress environment, but you really want to live up to the expectations that your boss has. And it's very helpful when they're also funny, you know? Uh -huh. It takes a little bit of the sting out of a out of a rough day. I also I think you were looking for a little more of a tidbit and yeah. a less political answer. Uh -huh. So I'll tell you the one thing that people don't often know about about the White House is that if you're a junior staffer, the, the only food option really is uh, these vending machines in the basement that you gotta bring exact change. That's an outrage. The West Wing has lied to us. You can't order Chinese food like CJ Craig. You just can't do it. Well, I did not vote for that. Well, nobody voted for that. We can the do better, America. USA! I romanticize the White House oh, and yeah. politics. So yeah. what's your favorite political movie ever? Favorite political movie ever? That's such a good question. My fellow Americans. You know what I love? What? An American president. Oh, Michael yeah. Douglas and yeah. that Benning. Oh, oh come yeah. on. Yeah. I classic. am it's the president. I should have played that role. You should have. All right. Do the remake. You know what we should do? Let's do a buddy political comedy about us both running for president against Super each down. Other. That's okay. great. And then do we become running mates at the end? Yeah. Mm -hmm. it's okay. a Don't spoil it for oh, the sorry. people. All right. Now, shoot. Right. Well, just... you just cut that part out. That's oh, fine. great. Yeah. All right, cut. <laughs>